Okay, here we go. We're going to take this A form and we're doing a B chord, but we're doing an A shaped B chord. The first thing we can do with this chord, once again, just some things we can do while we're on the A form is this, this minor pentatonic. We can also do pentatonic plus, which simply means we go and escalate all the way up, taking this A shaped form and playing all the notes in between it. There's literally dozens of ideas there. The third thing that we did was finding bend notes. No bend notes there. No bend notes there. There's a bend note there. There's a bend note there. The fourth thing we can do with this A form is also play a lower box. Which I call a four pack, which is kind of obvious why. One, two, three, four, duh. So we got pentatonic, penta plus, bend notes. That's an A form. You might find your own, but this is the ones that I these are the ones that I choose to do. The next form that we're gonna see after an A form, if I follow caged or on an A-shaped chord, the next one's gonna be a G-shaped chord. So I replace this finger with this finger. I've now changed position because I slid my hand from one place to another, from an A form to a G form. How do we use this one? Well, one, we can play the lower half of it. Or we can play the upper half of this G form. We can put them together. we can do with this G form is we bar these guys and we start practicing our middle ring and pinky pull-offs. Which is a lot of fun. And then slide out of it. 